Hello, Mum. And so, would you like me to read? Maybe a bit later, thank you. Very good. I know I'm. You all right? Yeah, good. Just talking about poor Renata. Such a lovely woman. Divorce can be so painful. Yeah. Anyway, celebration is in order. Oh. <laughs> we found a lovely villa by the sea. Be good if you would talk to John today. Get the money arranged. Oh, can't risk losing this one. Yeah, in Menorca. It is a lovely place. You should see it. Menorca, right? Mm. What do you want to go there for? Because you're driving me away. Mm. Every time we open a paper, there's something about you and the booze or the drugs, and you're breaking your poor mum's heart. Tell you what, I'll write you a check. Hmm? So she can go and buy a new one. Typical that you say something like that about me when I've given up so much for you. What have you given up for? Me? Your father, for a start. You really are a heartless monster. You know, I don't live my life in black and white. And I do not want your fucked up, frigid ideas about anything. <clears throat> you know, I am so sick of running away from who I am. <sighs> There's nothing wrong with success or pleasure. In fact, why am I apologizing for it, Mum? I have fucked everything that moves. And I've taken every drug known to man. All of them. Do you know what? I enjoyed every last minute of it. Ever since you first dangled your fat little legs in front of a piano, you've been lucky. You've never worked hard for a bloody thing in your life. It all just comes to you. You don't do anything. And I'm the one who suffers. I should never have had children. Do you know how disappointing it is to be your mother? 